what's up Pisces all right let's see what are the messages for Pisces right now that is very universal the Pisces need to know at this time messages for Pisces what's going on for Pisces watching at this time cups here emotional comforting judgment page of pentacles all right pisces so queen of cups all right so my feminines out there feminine energy you guys are feeling very very in your womanly power right now um masculines you also could just be in your feminine energy everyone has feminine and masculine in them okay but i feel like you're really comforting yourself you're really tending to yourself you're you're paying attention to your emotions your thoughts your feelings okay you're connecting with spirit um page of pentacles you guys could be working really hard very diligently towards it particular goal just maybe at your job you're very focused on the coin here you're looking for new opportunities okay you are you are looking for some chance or something to fall out the sky you know you're waiting for some sort of um Hmm, what I want to say, saving grace or something, okay, in regards to work, I feel like you've been working so hard, bottom of the deck, the tower in the reverse, so avoiding some sort of disaster here, yeah, you've been focusing on your coin, your money, you're about to be rewarded for that, for hard work, putting your head down, focusing on yourself, building slowly, Silently, for the most part. Judgment Day. Judgment Day is coming. And it's going to be a beautiful one. Like, Judgment Day is only scary for people. Justice in the reverse. Hold on, y'all. So, I dropped the Seven of Pentacles. All right. Justice in the reverse and Seven of Pentacles here. So, you've been focusing really hard on your money, um, your work, your career, your goals. I think it's it was to turn your back away from this um, betrayal, whatever this injustice was that was done to you, it pushed you into a level where you started to focus a lot on your money, Pisces. You started to focus on like your resources, started to maybe invest your money into multiple you know, businesses, multiple streams of income. You guys are really interested in that. I'm trying to figure out what you can do like long to make things last for a long time, long longevity. All right? Justice was in the reverse. I feel like the judgment here, um you're hoping for some sort of rebirth because of this situation. You're hoping that God will look out for you, spirit will watch out for you and 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 you know, validate you. Um, karma will be there for you in the best of ways, you know, because you feel like you deserve it. You've just been focusing. You've been really kind, compassionate, caring to people around you, focusing on your money, um, doing what's fair, doing what's honest, you know. And even though you've been that way, people haven't been that way towards you. All right. Could have um, had some betrayals from a Libra in particular. Okay, but with this sort, um, could be also someone in your workplace, something in your work environment. All right, but you've really just been taking whatever happened here and you turned your focus inward. So now you're just focused on your money, you're focused on your career, your business, your finance, um, your, your emotional strength, your spiritual strength. All right, bottom of the deck, queen of wands. So your beauty. All right, a lot of you guys are taking a lot of time on your hair, your nails, your skin, your eating habits. The emperor and the reverse. You could be dealing with the Aries. That person could have brought you a lot of um, injustice as well. 
All right, somebody very rigid. Yeah, the workplace, like a boss, like a rigid boss or something. Somebody that was just unfair to you. Could have treated you unfairly in regards to pay here. So you're waiting for a payoff. You're getting paid like bare minimum. Okay, some of y'all could be waiting for some sort of like, um, what do you call it, raise. Like you know that you deserve more money. All right, but you haven't really been complaining. You're still working. Hoping for something better to come along. Hoping for some sort of payoff. But, you know, you're getting bored. I feel like at what you are doing, I don't feel like you're too excited about it. You're just hoping for some sort of, sort of chance. Yeah, I feel like there's a lot of obstacles with with your expansion. Like, you want to be doing more. You had the Queen of Swords that was about to pop out, but she didn't in the reverse. Somebody may want to communicate with you, but they're not. They're not reaching out. They want to. Could be somebody you're at a distance with. Physically, too. Could be a distance. All right, but there's a lot of obstacles here, I feel like, in your workplace. Um, your work efforts. Like, you don't know the money's coming in, but it is coming in for you. This came out twice. Yeah, bottom of the deck here. Some sort of betrayal, heartbreak, um, deception. You're trying to get over some heartbreak. Or you were, like, working to get over this heartbreak, Pisces. All right. I feel like you're just, like, bored. You're, like, detached from people, from circumstances. It's just focusing on yourself right now and spirit and your emotions and trying to remain balanced. Um, these obstacles, you're trying not to let them get to you. You're just trying to remain detached from the outcome. All right. You also could be feel like you're getting played or you got played or something by, like, an Aries. Or Libra. Wow. So you have the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Um, bottom of the deck. Nine of Pentacles. Oh, right. Interesting. So I feel like, okay, something could have ended. You may have to leave some sort of work environment here. A lot of y'all, this is work situation. Like maybe you're going to get fired. Maybe this is a job you've been doing for way too long. You need to stop doing that. Like it's not going to work out and it's not meant to work out. Um, you have a lot more things you're supposed to do on your own terms. It could be like a, a business. Um, it could just be like embracing your natural habit, um, talents or whatever, and turning that, you know, using that as like a resource, but there's just something, it could just be getting a better job, a better title. All right. But there, whatever fails here, it was meant to, because emotionally you could, you can do a lot better. Like you're not emotionally, um, committed to the situation. Your emotions aren't, are in it. You're just doing it just to do it or maybe to please someone else or something like that. But it's not what you really need to be doing. And you're waiting for the payoff. You're being like very diligent, very, you know, loyal, whatever. But, um, I think a part of you thinks you're being too kind and that could be true. You could just be too, be too, too nice. And so the universe may just end something could be a relationship as well, Pisces. It could be, you know, a bad relationship that needs to end um, because you're emotionally detached anyway or somebody else is emotionally detached. All right. And you've been waiting. Could be, you know, waiting for things to, to you know, turn in your favor. You've put a, a lot of work and effort into the situation, but it's just like, ooh, it ain't working out, you know. Something has to end. Yeah, it could be with an Aquarius here, bottom of the deck, star card. I feel like you want to shine. You know, you're not shining where you are currently. And you know that you could shine brighter. You know that you could do more. You know that you can do more. And somebody's holding you back or a job's holding you back. Something is holding you back. And you can do so much better. All right, what's the advice for Pisces? God in the spirit universe What's the advice for Pisces at this time. What is the advice for Pisces? Watching. I'm not going to pull. Okay. Queen of Pentacles. All right. A lot of um, independent energy here. Queen of Pentacles. Um, you, financially, you're going to be well off. I feel uh, when it comes to relationships, when it comes to like organizations or maybe even a, an investment, like you invested in something that you thought was going to pay off. It wasn't the right 
focus point. It wasn't the right area you needed to be in. So I feel like with the Queen of Pentacles here, you're going to find a new focus that is really, um, it's going to provide a lot of abundance for you. All right. It could be like after you leaving a certain work environment or leaving a relationship, you find some sort of new like independence and you know, you're really going to be rewarded for that. Abundance is going to, um, be very, very evident in your life. Financially, you're going to be good. You're going to be really good. I feel like emotionally, you're going to be strong and steady too. Very stable. If you have like family, kids, um, you know, a uh, wife, husband, whatever, somebody is really going to find you like a very reliable, dependable person. All right. And you can depend on yourself as well. All right. You're going to stop waiting for people to um, give things to you, Pisces, and you're just going to go get what you know that you deserve. Alright, I just want to pull one more. I just want to pull one more. Yeah, you're recovering. You're recovering from all the heartbreak, the pain, the Five of Cups. You're accepting what is Five of Cups and Five of Pentacles, both in the reverse. So, yeah, you've been done, you know, pretty shitty from a lot of different people. But you're not letting that get to you anymore. Like, you're focusing on your strengths. You're focusing on what makes you feel um, connected, what makes you feel good about yourself, abundant. All right? Where... Like, what's that phrase? Home is where the heart is. Home is where the heart lies or something like that. So it's just like you have to find that place that you call home. You have to find that person that you call home because I feel like whatever you've been doing recently, you haven't been feeling that. You've been feeling some sort of loss. Um, and it's best now that, you know, you heal from that and move forward because you have some bright things in your future. All right. So let's get some super blunt messages from the Rebel deck. All right, if you're interested in this deck, the link will be below. All right, messages for Pisces. What does Pisces need to hear at this time? Messages for Pisces watching God and just very universe. Messages for Pisces watching at this time. Okay, I'll just go with this one real quick. All right, so it says your body is pissed at you. Get the fuck outside and move your ass, Pisces. All right, so if you've been slacking on the physical department, this is your message. All right. Oh, so there's two groups of people out there. There's people who've been slacking. And then the bottom of the deck here is like the total opposite. All right. You guys could be going through phases of like overeating and like extreme dieting right now too. All right. This says step away from the crazy making diet for a hot second. Kale and spirit, what? Spirulini, spirulini taste like ass. Eat some yummy shit. Bacon, chocolate, beer. Get some. Get the fuck outside, move your ass. Your body's pissed at you. So I feel like you guys could be going like from one extreme to the next here. I feel like balance is the real message for you, Pisces. Make sure that, you know, you're not um, restricting yourself so, so much where it becomes like, you know, psycho. <laughs> like you're not enjoying life, you know, especially it's your season. So if you want to have, you know, some cake or something, you know, sweet, do that, do it. Life is short, you know, enjoy what you can enjoy when you can enjoy it. All right. Everything is about moderation. So I feel like that's the message here. All right. Bottom of the deck again, take a shot. So Party it up. Don't take 12, take one. Okay, maybe two. <laughs> Move on. All right. So I feel like you have some new beginnings ahead of you. Um, you really do need to balance yourself, focus on yourself, focus on your body right now, what you put into your body, you know, exercising, pres preserving yourself, and also relax here. Take a shot. You know what I'm saying? It's your part, it's your season. So, you know enjoy it enjoy that shit okay 
So I truly hope these messages helped you. Thank you so much, Pisces, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.